Hi guys, here on warm24.com and today we will do assemble the smartphone Xiaomi Poco X5. At the very beginning we need to remove the card tray, for this we take a special tool and push out the tray for two SIM cards and a memory card. After that we need to heat the surface of the back core up to a temperature about 65-70 Celsius degree or 158 degree Fahrenheit. We use a heating mat, you can use a hair dryer. As we can see, the temperature increases to the temperature we want. And after 5 or 7 minutes, we can proceed to the assembly. To remove the back cover, we will use a plastic film. It is a protective film from the new display. We put it into the gap between the middle cover and the back cover and run it alone. We always need to be careful around the side buttons and the fingerprint sensor, because there may be cables in this area and they can be damaged. We also have to be careful around the cameras. As far as I know, the back cover separates from the camera's cover. The back cover will be taped around the camera's cover. And we open up the back cover. We only have the gasket on the cover. Ok, we move on to unscrewing the screws. We use 1.5mm Philips screwdriver or hash 3 o Then we remove the camera's cover bracket. And we can pick up and detach the camera's cover. As we can see, under the cover we have one screw and the connectors for the fingerprint sensor and the battery. We disconnect the connectors with a non-metal tool Then we unscrew the screw. And we move on to unscrewing the screws on the bottom. The screwdriver is the same, 1.5mm Phillips screwdriver. The screws are all the same, but we still recommend placing them on a special surface in an easy to remember order for reassembly. One screw will leave, it fixes the speaker assembly. And we can detach the middle cover. We use plastic film, we put the film in the gap around the hole of the card tray and gently slide it along, detaching the clips. As always, we have to be careful around the side buttons and the fingerprint sensor and around the cameras. And we detach the middle cover. We have contact pads and antenna transmission lines on the cover. We unscrew the one screw, securing the cover with a speaker. And we can detach the speaker assembly. There is also an element most likely related to the antenna. We disconnect the interboard cable connector, the coaxial cable connector and the connector for another coaxial cable. Then we pry at the edge and detach the subboard. On the subboard we have the charging port, microphone and other elements on the inside. 
and we move on to disconnect the display and interboard cable connector and disconnect the two connectors of the two coaxial cables. And we can detach the circuit board. Find a convenient place, hook it up and take out the motherboard. Now we can detach the front camera. After, we can disconnect and remove the rear cameras. If there is a copper thermal layer on the cameras, it is better to keep it intact for reassembly. Ok, we move on to removing the battery, we need to read on the brown tabs A and B which one we need to pull and we need to unwrap all of them so they don't interfere with the battery removal and don't hold it. And as it became clear from the description we have to pull on the tab A gently pulling up, detaching the battery. As we can see, the battery is also held on by a transparent protective layer that protects the interboard cable. Ok, this is the end of this disassembly. Thank you for watching and see you around. Ok guys, now we're done. Thank you for watching. If you like what we do, please consider subscribing to our YouTube channel or read our articles on our website. Take care of yourself and until next video.